Flannel. Yes. Hunter Dickinson will be back again next year. Your thought? Because he ain't going to the league. No, that's the Hunter Dickinson conundrum for the player, me. The preseason, the Sam Flannel unanimous college basketball <laughs> preseason player of the year. I didn't think he was. I thought there was a chance, but obviously he hasn't had the type of year that would warrant that kind of an honor. The Hunter Dickinson conundrum is a tough one because he hasn't been bad by any stretch of the imagination. If he comes back next year, he's probably going to finish top five Michigan all-time in points and rebounds. And that's just factual. And I understand that. In his freshman season, he was the leading scorer and rebounder on a team that made the Elite Eight. And he's been the leading scorer and rebounder on every single Michigan team that he's played on. He hasn't been bad. But the thing that bothers me about Hunter Dickinson is that he wants to sort of be that villain kind of that guy that everybody hates without the resume. He wants to be Christian Leitner. He wants to even be Mo Wagner, but he ain't either of those people by the numbers. He wore a ski mask and talked shit about Wisconsin and their fans and their players called them, what, scumbags, and then goes out and they lose a game in which they, (laughs) Wisconsin, (laughs) yes, in which Wisconsin does not score a single field goal for the last 10 minutes of the game. He he didn't have a field goal either, the, the whole second half, right? He... I don't think so. No, he was he, he was bad. That's that's how are you gonna wear a ski mask into the building I just, and not have a field goal in the second half? No, I just that's the issue with, with Hunter Dickinson. I mean, talking smack about MSU, saying that they're gonna beat what was it, Arizona State by thirty, and then lose it, and well. then lose by thirty, losing, getting six rebounds against CMU. I mean, his numbers this season they still look pretty. They look about what they did last year, but. His freshman season, he was a second-team All-American on an Elite Eight team, and now he's an underachieving. He's not a but, but that's the thing. He's not a bum as a player. Sam, he's just underwhelming. Here's my question. Yeah. Is Hunter Dickinson, am I watching and listening to a guy that has continued to regress, like get worse? Not, that's not, fair. Not only like just as far as and, and, and – 